Hey everyone, just wanted to do a quick tutorial video on something that I find super useful um, for the Google Pixel. Um, it's called call screening. It's pretty much a really good way to keep from distractions and um, uh, negate any robocalls or any spam callers from calling your phone. Usually what you normally would do is when say someone calls you or a spam caller calls you, you'll decline it. But what that does is it, you know, it automatically distracts you. So What's really, what's really cool is inside the phone app, obviously you click the phone app right here. Then you're gonna hit the three buttons at the top right hand corner. Then you're gonna hit settings. Then you're gonna hit spam and call screen. And so this right here is actually just gonna show you exactly um, all the features in it. So you see caller and spam ID. I have that turned on so I can actually see exactly um, who the caller is and sometimes it's not always spam and sometimes it's not always a uh, robot caller But this allows me to actually see the person calling You can turn that on and off if you want to um, And there's also the actual call screen feature where I'm gonna click that and click right into that So that you can have it right here so that you can save the call screen audio So when that audio happens and I'm gonna show you that in, in a minute um, You can save the actual audio that comes in from the caller um, you can also change the settings to um, have the phone ring if this if, this, if the spam caller, or you can have it automatically decline the, the caller or the automatically screen the call, or you can just have it silently decline at the same time. And the middle option is the option you want to use when you actually want to use the Google Assistant call screening option. And then for possible faked numbers, say like. Say for instance, someone creates a fake number from an app and they start spamming, pe spamming people on calls. Um, you can turn that feature on too. Same thing, you can have it actually ring your phone or you can have it automatically screen, uh, decline the robocall. Um, and I have it also to set up so that for so if it's a first time caller, I have it so that it'll still actually ring my phone just in case if it's someone that's not in my contacts or say someone that um, I just gave my number out to them for like a business uh, um, setup or something like that, it can still ring my phone or I can have it automatically screen. As of right now, for me, that doesn't work. Um, also, you can have it so that any private or hidden calls can be automatically screened so that you obviously won't get those nor will you see those. But again, you'll still be able to see the or listen to the actual audio of that actual um, call. Also, a really cool feature is you can actually change the voice of the um, rope, the um, Google Assistant call. So, for instance, here's an Hi, option. The person you've reached is using a screening service from Google and will get a transcript of this call. Go ahead and say why you're calling. See, so that's one option. And another option is this second voice right here. Hi, the person you've reached is using a screening service from Google and will get a transcript of this call. Yeah. So that's just that's just one option. There's two options you have there, but in a second I'm going to show you guys exactly what it looks like when someone calls you. So let's just say you're scrolling through your phone, say you're on social media or Twitter or whatever, and you start to receive a call. You can now either accept it, decline it, or use the screen call feature. And you'll actually see with this interaction how this actually works. As you can see, the Google Assistant is actually speaking to the caller themselves, and you actually will be able to hear the caller. Fatima, calling to say I love you. So here I was able to tell the Google Assistant to ask the caller to tell me more about why they're calling. Hey, just calling to say that I love you. And with that, you can actually decline it, answer it, Call me back. Or you can have them call you back. What's also really neat is that you can actually go into the phone app again and look at the recent call list and actually see this transcription of that call that was just phone screened by the Google Assistant. You can share it, you can delete it, you can play it back right then and there. And you can actually read it if you wanted to by clicking the transcription part. And here, as you can see, this is the actual transcription of the conversation that my wife had with the Google Assistant with the call screen. So with that being said, that's pretty much all I have for you guys. I appreciate you guys watching this. This is one of my longer videos, so if you can please like and subscribe and comment below so that I can get better on the next one. Again, thanks for watching.